Hello, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your woman Angela K O D. Today we are making corned beef cabbage stew with yam. Come with me and let's make this delicious healthy meal together. By family to this channel, please subscribe and be part of this great family. And for my subscribers and everyone watching my videos, thank you so much. For your love and support, I really appreciate you guys always coming along. Come with me and let's go together. By the way, hit the notification bell so that when I make a video, you will be the first person to know. Like my videos and let's go together. Thank you. For ingredients, we'll be needing our corned beef, onions and shredded and garlic, garden peas, stock cube and curry powder, blended pepper and ginger, tomato puree, baby carrot, a gushi, tomato sauce, homemade tomato sauce, oil, zucchini, cabbage, salt to taste, and our yam. So these are the ingredients we'll be needing for our cooking. Go ahead and add some oil, just a little bit of oil because of the cabbage. I want my curry powder to infuse in the oil, so I'm first going to add the curry powder. Once my curry powder has infused a little bit in the oil, I'll go ahead and add the shredded garlic and onions in my oil. This process makes your food really smells really the the aromas it brings. It's really awesome because of the curry powder being infused in the oil. And this is really a fast food, I would say. It doesn't take much time. So these onions are going to cook for just one minute. I'll go ahead and add all other things. I'll go ahead and add my blended pepper and onions. Sorry, it's blended pepper and ginger. Sorry. I'll go ahead and add my tomato paste. Go ahead and add my tomato sauce. Now add one stock cube. I'll go ahead and chop my zucchini any shape of your choice but in this type of cooking I'm going for this Go ahead and add my zucchini. Now stir it through. This is one of the tricks my mother taught me. Anytime you're cooking a gushi in your stew and you want it to kettle. So they're gonna for you can say abu bono self is a gushine buba. The best way to do it is to just go ahead and add salt direct to your gushi. And you stir it in, we yes, sir. It will really your uh, gushi will kettle really good, like putting eggs in your uh, in your stew. And so this is the method that my mother taught me. Let's go ahead and put the gushi in it. Yes. And I'll 
go ahead and cover it up on a medium heat before we come back our dish will be kedo and as you push in the bed ever will book come at the said they would do kusia a year you know. this cabbage stew looks very special but it doesn't take much time you can use just 10 or 15 minutes and make it for dinner after a long day from work until not try the why try the pie just give it a try and you'll probably will enjoy it Let's check on our stew. Just have a look. It's really doing very, very well. I can see the agushu will really care do it. Babu Bankasa. With the end resource, it's going to surprise you. Go ahead and then we cook our yam. Minim will say you put on say then because I had the beca to say you put on some. To salt to your taste, so just a little bit of salt is okay, and then I'll go ahead and cover it until it's all cooked together. Then you know, baby, it's just yeah. This is authentic Ghana corn beef cabbage stew. Just a pepper beef. Look, just have a look. And you grow. Flavors never hana. And maybe see. We go ahead and add our corn beef. And the main ingredients for this recipe is our corn beef. So you don't just mash it, just into little pieces and then put it in because it's going to melt by itself and no other day then at the end of the day when you are serving you are going to get pieces in it for children uh -huh. so what about you are saying i think so will be in fear <laughs> Some others also like meat, so it's not only for children. So it's only be so no more your mother. Let's check on our stew. Just have a look. You see, as I said, it's already melted. So now we can go ahead and fold everything in. So we did not add any water to this sauce when we're adding the zucchini. As, as you can see, everything is cooking perfect, just the way we want it. I'll go ahead and add my baby carrots and then the garden peas. Everything will go in like this. And then without wasting time, I'll just go ahead and add my cabbage. Just like this. I'm not going to stir it in. I'll go ahead and cover it up because I need the steam to cook this cabbage. Let's check on our yarn. It's also doing perfect. But with this particular sauce, anytime I make this sauce, sometimes we change our mind and use it for rice. It can go with spaghetti, it can go with rice, but today it's going with yam. Whether they like it or not, we are going to enjoy it with yams. Let's see how this goodness is doing. And we said, just have a like. Wow. The sauce is ready. Then you're watching all the video. Just have a look. 
Shade. 100% pure. Look. Look at all the goodies here. Yeah, we it's done. It's really done. Yeah, we just look. Just look. So I'm going to taste for salt to see if I have to put more salt or not. It's perfect. Really, really perfect. I'm not going to add any salt to it. It's super. Our sauce is ready. Yeah, she. You can read my channel. Just have a look. Time to save. Time to serve. Just have a look. And let the me buy me run where did no crack a crab ya mommy. Send the baron is a talent. Wow, just have a look. This one is almost like potatoes, but it tastes better than potatoes. Trust me. If you eat this one, you are not going to eat potatoes anymore. Let's dig in. Just have a look. Wow, just have a look, guys. I will say, send a mechanic, send a year, a good shino, a kedon, and send your dukusi. I think a goon. Just have a look at this. Wow, the combination of the sakini and all these ingredients makes this really amazing. Thank you so much. You can never eat corned beef cabbage stew without eggs. So this is our eggs to go with. Just have a look. Food is ready. Said. This is authentic Ghana corned beef stew. Papa B. Thank you so much for coming with me. To make this delicious healthy meal guys by follow to this channel please what are you waiting for please 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 subscribe and be part of this great amazing family and for my subscriber and everyone watching my videos thank you so much for your love and support i really appreciate you guys always coming along with me thank you so much thank you thank you thank you and may god bless you Thank you. I will see you in my next video. Bye. Kiss, kiss. God bless you. Bye.